Hey guys, Jess teaches Tuesday with your scaling options for the Tuesday workout, 10 a.m. So if you don't have a kettlebell, but you do have your dumbbells, you'll do dumbbell swings. To hold the dumbbell for the dumbbell swings, interlock your fingers around the dumbbell, thumbs come on top. So you're holding the top head of the dumbbell. Same principle applies for the movement, hips back, hips forward. If you're like, coach, I don't have dumbbells, what do I do? Use your jug. Okay, hold the handle of the jug, hips back, hips forward, 15 each side. Okay, so 15 right arm swings, switch, 15 left arm swings. If you're like, dude, I don't wash my clothes, I don't know what to do. So single, leg deadlift body weight only right so right arms going to my left toes and my right leg kicks back touch and pull through touch and pull through 15 each side for your dumbbell push press i don't have dumbbells use your jug fingertips come through the handle close around again the palm is to the sky for this so you can keep your elbow forward, dip, drive, overhead, 15 total, sorry, 15 total. If you're OCD about it, go 16 total, eight on the right, eight on the left. Dude, I don't wash my clothes, I don't have a jug, what do I do? You can do a dive bomber, okay? So you're getting a little bit of an angle on the shoulders, which is what we're looking for. So you start almost in a downward dog position. My elbows stay tight to my body. I dive my head to the floor, swoop up. One more time, then I push back. Tuck my elbows in, dive my head to the floor, swoop up, okay? Or if you're feeling like that's too sexy for workouts. You can do a push up with your feet elevated. So you can use your couch and table. I put my feet on my bench. I dive my head close to the floor. Either one acceptable. For your dumbbell pull through, I don't got dumbbells. You can use your jug if you want to, right? Pull your jug through. If not, shoulder taps, because you don't wash your clothes. One, two, three. Hope that helps everyone. See you Tuesday for Just Teaches Tuesday at 10 a.m.